Hey guys, so welcome back to my YouTube channel and today's tutorial is how to make that really cool motion graphics background with Vegas Pro 19. Now this tutorial is applicable for uh, all version of Vegas Pro uh, at certain extent because one of the effects that I'm trying to replicate here where the background sort of bend to create this sort of 3D depth, those effects are only exclusive for Vegas Pro 19 users. And make sure you update your Vegas Pro 19 to the latest version, which is update 4. Uh, at the moment, update 4 is the latest version, so you, you want to make sure that you update it because that affects are exclusive on the latest update, okay? So, first thing first, you want to go to the media generator. And we want to add the noise te texture over here, which is the stereo sky and uh, you want to play around with the fre fre frequency offset and the noise parameters okay so you want to make sort of a vertical line so we're gonna just reduce the y-axis so we have our vertical line and straight off the bat it looked pretty good okay and you can play around with the min and max setting here which is the noise parameters which affects the intensity or the basic shapes of the lines here okay and how intense it you want it to be okay you want to make the line sort of long i'm gonna make it decrease the amplitude here okay and increase a bit more yep okay this is all boils down to your personal preference to make the animation you just have to animate the y-axis over here okay and I feel it's barely seeing a thing. All right. Okay, so to animate the the um, the lines here, you just have to animate the offset here. So I'm gonna press the animate button here to add a keyframe on the noise texture and go to the very end of the event and just move the keyframe down, slide it on. So we have this our animation. At the moment, it feels very slow. So I'm gonna set the beginning of the keyframe a bit higher so that it goes from 5 all the way down to negative 5 so that the animation will be slightly more faster if it's still not faster for you you can shorten the length of the keyframes and maybe shorten the length of the event and conform it with the length by clicking this button so we have a better looking animation here okay and then we just copy paste to make a perfect loop so now i'm going to change the color to let's just say red okay remind me of netflix intro and that's look pretty cool all right so now we want to bend this graphic here so that's where you go to the video effects and search for a plugin called Mesh Warp. So you're gonna drag and drop it into the uh, event, and straight away you can see it points here on our preview window. So we wanna increase the grid on our mesh, not too much, just you know uh, that you feel that it's enough for you to bend. Have the points here. I think 16 is good enough, and you wanna increase the elasticity of the mesh all the way to 100%. Now this mesh behavior are new in Vegas Pro 19, which they just added here on the version, sorry, on the update for, okay? That is that is why I say, update your Vegas 19 to the latest uh, version, which is the update for. Okay, anyway, um, let's bend it, um, the line here. So we're gonna pull the very end here outside, like so, and this may take you some times to get the effects that you're looking for okay so you have to play around the mesh warp right so i think that's great enough now let's add the text so just right click insert a video track you're gonna right click and then insert text media I'm gonna type in hello and I want to choose the animation number two all right let's look pretty cool and let's copy paste it 
let's rename this to Vegas and I want to have transition in between but before that let's just disable the animation for the second text okay so we just have the crossfade and we want to go to transitions and I want to use the GL transitions and let's use the wind um, preset and that's look pretty cool let's lengthen the transitions all right and yeah we have the basic look of the effects and um, you can add a sort of shadows down here so you just add another video track above and then you want to go to your media generator go to solid color you can add a black color on top let's just cut the very end here and you want to use the masking here okay enable mask use this ellipse tool make round like this and increase the feathering to a bunch like so and you can tone down the opacity just like that and let's add another one down here and then increase the feathering to a bunch and that will sort of create a really nice depth or perspective it doesn't have to be perfect okay and you can see the text is sort of below the shadow here so i'm going to put it on top and i feel the bending is not look real so you're just gonna play around till it looks realistic to your eye okay this may take some time to do but yeah just like so and that's look pretty cool and you can parent track of a dam convert it to 3d source alpha and have sort of a perspective animation like so zoom it a bit more and yeah so that's the basic on how you create the graphics here in Vegas Pro and I hope you guys like this tutorial and you can download the project which is the link in the description down below and thank you guys for watching and until next time see you on my next video bye bye